guys, what's going on? Eaton476 here, bringing you my second episode in my Mountain Blade Warband A New Dawn series. Uh, in the last episode, we have enlisted in the King's Army, and we are now... Oh, we are now have a battle. <laughs> and uh, we enlisted in the King's Army, we recently leveled up to the rank of Militia. Um, or Regular, actually. I think I'm thinking of the wrong army. We certainly have... Oh, wow. Lag. <laughs> there we go. Let me just see... Oh, it's still four. Lag. Okay, anyway. Um, yeah, we've certainly had a... We've had an equipment upgrade. So we now no longer have... We now have an even sharper stick. But at least this one doesn't have a spike on the end. This one actually has a, um, a spear. We've got a two-handed spear and then a one-handed spear we can use with the... Shield. Well, I seem to have two shields. Okay. <laughs> Talk about being overly protective. Uh, this fight, it's only a little one, so I'll be lucky if I can get a uh, look in, but we'll see. I did actually go into the config files and try to change it back to a smaller battle size, but it doesn't seem to have worked, so I'll have to have another look at that. Because at the minute I'm getting a little bit of lag, which I don't really like, if I'm honest. Okay, those guys are dead. <laughs> Come on, don't kill everyone. Save some for me. Oh, he's still alive. Come on. Come on. I'm blocking this horse. I'm not letting him get to him. No, 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 no. Ah, oh, no, I'm not going to get that guy. Ah, oh, that's annoying. Okay. Well, you get missions, you get XP for being, for taking part in battles anyway, so. Uh, I'll have to have a look, see. Tap key to leave. Anything worth taking? No. Let's have a look. Yeah, still 175. Oh, there. Current rank is regular. So experience to next rank is 175. Let's return back to duty. So yeah, unfortunately, uh, this sort of part of the game is kind of not boring, but uh, you have less control over what you do, so you've basically got to follow the pack. Now, while we're in... Um, while we are stationed in Jalcala, I'm going to sell this extra store. I don't need the pony. don't need the falcon. I don't need the crossbow, the bolts, the... I'm just going to sell everything, I think. Because we want to save up as much money as possible. Uh, we could buy some land. Four acres of that. Uh, buying an existing acre costs 1,000. Okay. How much do you get every two weeks? The rent paid to landowners currently accumulates to 109 dinars per acre for every two weeks. Yeah, so what's that? Four hundred and thirty-six dinars every two weeks for a four K investment. It's not really worth it. We shall return to duty. See if we get more money. Well, I want to buy a business. That'll be the, that'll be more profitable. Hoping that our king decides. Oh, here we go. Eight hundred twenty-nine versus twenty-seven. I'm hoping that we have a siege of some kind because when you have a siege, you tend to uh, you tend to have a lot more opportunity to do more damage, hence more XP, etc., etc. I don't need to level up; just double checking. If we look on the map. Our enemies are actually in that direction. Oh yeah, there they are. You can see them on the hill. Yeah, I really do need to turn down these battle size. And down this battle size. It's getting a little bit laggy for my liking. My well, gents. <laughs> Feel a little bit stranded out here. I'm currently taking... Oh, okay. Okay. I think I need to back up a little bit. Ah. <laughs> I'm getting so many things thrown at me. Okay, let's go. There's one guy down. the guy down. Oh, this is good. This is good. Oh, he's a bit more heavily armoured. Oh, my spear can't even go through his... There we go. Pen managed to penetrate his armour. It's a problem when, when you've got this... Oh, no. When you've got this little um, sort of quality of weapons, it's okay to take on these sort of footmen because you can at least penetrate their armour and do some damage. But 
when you're against sort of these guys, and they've got proper chainmail or plate armor, etc. There we go, another guy. Um, oh, there we go. Getting this. Oh, ow! I took a big hit then. Come on. Block that hit. Trying to kill him before these archers kill him. Oh, come on. Oh, what? Okay. That happens a lot. <laughs> oh, yeah, one thing you can do in these battles is pick up weapons that are off the floor. So I've now got this two handed claymore, uh, which will be a lot better than my spear. Unfortunately, <laughs> the battle is kind of already over. They've only got, they've got a few guys left. I don't know where they are. Oh, Lester, these guys have got like. These guys are like rapid fire, rapid firing crossbows. It's sort of like lower damage, higher rate of fire. Whereas snipers, there's like two sort of trees off. Whereas they are these sharpshooters are sort of high damage, low rate of fire. Ooh, this battle line. Damn, there's loads of soldiers. Yeah, I really need to turn down these battle sizes. Otherwise, this is just going to get stupid. I'll probably do that in the ne after the next episode and try it out properly. There you go, I'm taking blood loss damage. No, where is this last guy? Oh, he's he's currently routing. Let's see if I can go and find him. My guy is really slow. <laughs> he walks so funny as well. Um, he's nearly at the edge of the map now. Sounds like we've won. Oh no, I don't want to retreat. There we are. Okay. Mm, no, I don't need that. Return to duty. See if I've got any. Oh, there we go. I can now be. I'll now be promoted on the next payday. It's April sixth. Oh, cool. Pretty soon. I don't need to. Don't need to level up. What I might do in future episodes is kind of um, cut this sort of travelling out from the video and basically just skip it to the... Oh, he's dropped off 100 soldiers. I swear we had 400 before. Okay, all right. Um, so I'll cut out this travelling because sometimes it can take quite a while before we actually find something. Guy doesn't like to venture out of his far out of his home, does he? Prisoners inside the dungeon of Jamaid Castle have, have escaped. That's pretty cool. April 5th, we're nearly at our promotion date. Now we just double check Rodok. Uh, so we're going. We could be a spearman. What do they get? Just a spear, nothing more fancy than that. Let's see about footmen, what do they get? Do they look a bit better? Mace, cleavers, yeah, I'll probably be, I'll just be a footman. Oh yeah, yeah, I was, I'm going to have to be if I want to be a champion. Praetorian guards look pretty cool. But they just don't look anywhere near as cool as champions. Check there's not a tournament on. No, there isn't. Hey, there we go. Now, go to the rank of footman. See what I've got. So, an old pavas. Brong? Brong? I don't know how you pronounce that. Broing? Broing? Anyway. 
Much better armor. Shield. Footman's hammer. I've got a war spear as well. Let's put that on my back anyway. Okay. Cool. So now we need to... 457 experience till the next... Oh. I don't want to speak to King Gravis. 457 experience till my next rank up. I'm hoping the king decides to go and siege a castle. That'll make things a lot more interesting. Can actually have a half decent fight. Okay, we seem to be on the move. Another, th uh, another main thing with this uh, mod is that minor factions like Barbarians or um, the Slavers or the Highlanders, they can have huge sort of collect like war bands pop up and that are sort of like this King's army is 440 strong. Like that's that's a big army. They can have armies up to 76, sorry 96, that's all right. They can have armies over a thousand strong. So they can be really hard to deal with. And actual f actually they can sort of really destroy a faction not completely because the faction main factions will always usually survive slightly but um okay we seem to have a bit of lag in this one um they can really sort of damage a faction and establish themselves quite a foothold actually and some of them can become sort of semi-permanent uh, in the game just by taking a few towns Okay, so we can see our enemies over the hill there. Our guys, sort of, they've they've they have a proper battle line. We're just everywhere at the minute. Our archers are kind of skirmishing with theirs. The thing I love about this game is that it, it, it if the the AI actually not not really in the vanilla game to be fair. In the vanilla game, they are awful at trying to direct their forces, but in the vanilla game, they really do work well at sort of having battle formations, so um, archers skirmish at the front, cavalry might circle around the flanks waiting for a uh, waiting for a, a correct charge, and then you'll have the infantry sort of behind the archers that will charge. Oh, I missed the javelin then, so close. Okay, I think I think I'm air engaging now. I'm going to start taking out the archers, because they will be easy pickings for me. Oh, oh, not when I get hit by... Okay, this lag is getting pretty stupid now. I need to turn the battle sizes down. <laughs> See if I can know this guy. Ah. Uh. Ah, uh, ah, uh. no, 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 no. Okay, I've been caught up in the thick of it here. I can't even see what I'm doing, let alone what you guys can see. Oh, no. Uh, no mind out the way. Come on, come back here. No, that juggernaut's gonna get him. God's sake. Okay. Alright. Wow, look how many men we've got. <laughs> no wonder it's lagging. <laughs> oh, seven battle axe, that'll help. If there is any guys left. No, everyone's dead. Well, that was great. <laughs> God. Oh wow, my shield sponged two hits for me. That's that's pretty helpful. Server, mail mittens. Okay, some, some okay loot here. We will return to duty. Ooh, here we go. 440 troops fit for battle against the enemy's 590. Ouch. And it looked like Swadia as well that we were fighting, so... I don't know whether we'll win this one. But I have to fight, so I'm part of the King's Army, so... There's going to be some hella lag in this battle. <laughs> oh, I'm not looking forward to this. Here we go. We've got proper skirmishing lines now. So there, most of their forces will be made up of knights on a horseback. 
They have pretty strong foot soldiers, not as strong as ours. Um, hopefully, our archers are going to have to try and pick off some of their soldiers um, beforehand for this to make it to make us being somewhat able to take them out. Um, yeah. I'm probably going to die in this. I don't really want to because if you survive to the end of a big fight like this, you'll always usually get something decent. So I might just sort of try and hide behind <laughs> that rock there <laughs> and hope for the best. <laughs> hope the knight doesn't come and just like take me out halfway through. But they've got um, some mounted units called Twilight Knights. And they are they are more tanky than Juggernauts, which are probably one of the most tanky units in the game. Just by the name, you can tell that they're ridiculously overpowered. I wish they are. Um, so those Twilight Knights are going to be a real pain. I don't know if our men is going to be able to... I mean, we've, we've got a lot of spearmen, so... And obviously the crossbowmen are going to really play a huge part in this. At the minute, they're kind of just exchanging fire. From this distance, uh, it's, they can't really be accurate. Even the snipers aren't going to be accurate enough. And if they do hit anything, it's going to be play armor and shield, so... They probably won't actually kill anything, so it's kind of... I would move up, but with my armor, I'd probably just get rinsed by crossbow shot, crossbow fire. I'm hoping that they follow me if I push forward. Try and take some cover behind something. Oh god, there's nothing. I've got a lake at the bottom here. Yeah, if you look around me, there's crossbow bolts flying at my feet. I'm going to try and get behind a tree. Keep going. Okay. There you go, they're pushing forward now. Oh god, I need to, I need to get back to my army. Oh, safety and numbers. Oh Jesus, look at that. That's like charge of the that's like charge of the light brigade. We're gone into the water. Should not have done that. Wow, that is a big cavalry charge. Our men are just throwing themselves into it. Uh, this is a knight. He's he's pretty strong. My guy, it's fine. Oh, I can't see what's going on. <laughs> that knight. Oh, God. Man at arms. No, no, no. Go away. See if I can get his weapon. Can I pick up his weapon? No. Oh. oh. Just took a hit. We're fine. Okay. Judging by the... Oh, Christ. <laughs> see, this battle is going to be horrible. The thing is, I want to find a better weapon on the floor. And help out this game. Oh, come on. Oh, Christ. Military hammer. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme. Give no, 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 no. There we go. Got it. Right, that'll be better than what I've got. Can't tell if we're winning or losing. We're certainly taking casualties, but so are they. So I don't really understand. It kind of seems like even at the minute. Oh, here we go. Yes, horse AI. Keep him there. Let's just hack at him with the hammer. I'm not really doing any damage. I'm injuring the horse, but I'm not injuring... Oh, God. A knight's turned up. Uh, I can't fight these guys on my own. I need some help. I can't fight these guys full stop, but... Oh, Christ. That's a Twilight Knight. They're kind of distinguishable by their black armor. Oh, no. I can't go toe-to-toe -to -toe with this guy. <laughs> Help. <laughs> oh, God. See if I can fight. If I can kill him, I'm going to have so much XP. It's not even funny. This is going to test my fighting abilities. Oh, no. There's more involved. This isn't fair. I'm getting ganged up on. So, I mean, this guy is, like, level 50. I'm at level 4. Uh, one more hit and I'm done. No, I'm done. Oh, come on. It's so annoying. I was getting ganged upon. So, 
<sighs> okay, yeah, Twilight Knight. <laughs> level 50 versus level, what, 4, 5, something like that. That's fair. Okay, well, I've got a few options. I can either A, uh, let them fight it out, or B, I can retreat, and it might let me come back into the... It might restart the fight and let me come back into it, so I'm going to try that. Uh, it doesn't look like we're winning it. I don't know. I can't really tell. Everyone's everyone's kind of taking casualties, so... But they still have loads of guys over there. Don't know how to speed up the camera. Okay. Well, we will retreat from this fight. Well, I, I'm retreating from this fight anyway. Okay. How much have they... Let's see how much they've lost. Uh, enemy, oh, no, that's the kill count. So, enemy casualties have had 73 killed. That's not that many. 84 killed. Yeah, considering we had less to begin with, that's bad, that's bad. 321 versus 517. Ouch. I'm beginning to think Rodox might not have been the best choice. But we shall see. This fight will have given me enough XP anyway to... I don't, yeah, I don't know actually, it should it should do, give me enough XP to rank up to the next level. Next time, I might use, just use my spear. But look at how much health I've started out with this time around, because I'm wounded from the last fight, so... I probably won't survive this fight. And I doubt we will either. Unless there are, the rest of their army is made up with really low tier troops, which is a possibility actually for the Swadia. Because um, they usually tend to either have sort of top tier knights, e.g. Twilight Knights, which we've <laughs> which we've had the pleasure of meeting, um, or oh, look at that. That's nice. Like hold the line. These guys are pretty cool. Praetorian Honor Guard. They're really strong. Um, yeah, they usually tend to have either max knights or sort of footmen, like my sort of level. And considering we have like Praetorian Guard um, and s and champions in our army, uh, I imagine if we get rid of the sort of their top spec troops, and there's a good chance that we can win this. But we'll have to see. Thankfully, their other units are actually a lot closer this time, so our crossbowmen can have a much better chance of taking them out. Everyone seems to be just punching straight up. This is going to be pretty decisive. Oh, there's Twilight Knight. Let's see if I can injure him. I didn't even do any damage to that guy. Oh god, I'm just going to get charged in this. Oh, we're getting pushed back. Yeah, see their knights are just plowing through our men. Oh, Twilight Knights, no. Run away. Oh. oh, I'm not dead. How am I not dead? Okay. Oh god, look at how many casualties we're taking. That's bad. Yeah, we've, we've, we've definitely lost this fight. Oh. Oh. No. No. Oh, god's sake. Okay. Well, I'm dead. Let me see how the battle's going from up here. Yeah, we're being rinsed. Oh god, look at all those casualties. Purple and pink mean that our guys died. Blue means that we've killed one of theirs. So, that kind of puts it into perspective how many guys we've lost. I don't even know why the king decided to take this army on. Okay, we're retreating from this fight. <laughs> Yeah, I'm too wounded to fight, so it won't actually let me fight this one. We can now just see from the battle map how it goes. So return to duty. If the king has any, if the high king has any sense, yeah, there you go. I've been taken prisoner. Great. So now I'm not even part of our army anymore. <laughs> well, that's just fantastic. There we go. Oh, sick and free. Okay. Where are they? Where am I? 
Can't see me. Where am I? Okay. Can I move away? Yeah, I can. Okay, let me see if I can get back to Delcala, because that's our sort of stronghold. Now, me being on my own, <laughs> there's a very high chance that I'll get attacked by bandits, so I've just got to watch where I'm going. There you go, there's some bandits. They're too far away, though. I can, I can outrun them. Just going to skip a little bit forward. Ox Hall. Where is Ox Hall? It's pretty close. Oh, it's there. Okay, but I can't really. I've got to get back to the army. Keep going. <laughs> Keep wandering, Brian. It seems to be pretty clear, actually, this uh, this road. We are back to Jelkala. Is the king there? No, he's still. Is there any... There's a count here. I can ask him if he's still... Because count the other NPCs know where people are somehow. <laughs> so I'm gonna ask. He knows. Not not your skills. I don't want to know how OP you are. Location: King Graveth. Held captain of Praven. Ah, okay. Let's see what Arwa says. Mother of the Saranids and their rightful queen. Hmm. Oh, this must be one of the characters. Yeah, you can. You instead of having your own kingdom, you can actually help someone reclaim. They base. She's basically of highborn, and she thinks that she should be the king, the queen of the Saranid Sultanate. So, you can actually support her cause, and through that, you'd probably become her marshal, which is a pretty high position of power. Okay, so we're gonna have to wait here then. Well, actually, I could go to Ox Hall while I'm waiting. How long have I got to wait? Eighteen days. Oh, I could easily go to Ox Hall then. Okay. I'll head to Ox Hall and take part in the tournament there. Ooh, I didn't see those highwaymen. That could have been interesting. So while I'm waiting for King Harless to be freed... Oh, hi King Graveth, sorry, I should say. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, shit. Shit. I'm being chased by highwaymen. I can go around them. I'm going fa I'm. I walk faster than they do. Oh, God's sake. Okay, I'm gonna have to go over this mountain range. Try and outrun them. See, if I had a horse, I could probably take them, but... Because I'm on my own. Okay, so we can we we move faster than they do. So yeah, they've just given up. More pillagers, we can outrun them. Cutthroats, we can. Oh, ah. Oh. <sighs> One versus fifteen. <laughs> Never tell me the odds. Okay, this should be interesting. <laughs> Battle advantage minus fourteen. All right, come on, I have faith. I need a place. I need a place where I have tactical advantage. Where are they? How far off are they? Okay, I've got a bit of time to figure this one out. So I'm going to use my hammer because I can probably swing fastest with that. What's probably going to happen is they're going to sort of be in a line. Yeah, there they are. They're probably going to be in a line. So I'm going to be walking back and hitting them. Spear probably is too slow. Yeah, and it's got the tendency to bounce. So I'll go one-handed. I reckon I might be able to take out half of them. See, oh no, I don't want to retreat. See, the bandit, the bandit leader, is probably going to be the main issue. Are they pillagers? Oh, they're throwing axes. So I'll stay at the crest of this hill, so they can't hit me. Um, the bandit leader is probably going to be the main one. So the pillagers and robbers really aren't that. They could probably go down in sort of two hits. I'm already low health. Why am I low health? Okay. See, look how smooth it is when there's not loads of ah uh, blood loss. That's cruel. So I've now basically got a time limit as to... Okay, so I've got to try and take out these early guys. Right, one down. See, they'll try and surround... Oh no, oh, they're routing. Okay. Come on. No. So it's basically hit and block. Uh, advanced level 5. Why are they running away? That's so annoying. Oh, I'm being surrounded here. This is not good. No. <sighs> Ranged weapons are going to be the death of me.
Yeah, I can deal with this when they're all in front of me. Things it's gonna be a lot harder to block uh to damage. God these th these guys take a few hits. I've hit him so many times. There you go. Finally, right. A few guys down. Come on. <laughs> you pussies, get back here. Come on. Nice. Awesome. And they're running away. Thing is, my uh, athletic skill is probably too slow to catch up to them to gain the XP. We are victorious on this day. <laughs> One footman versus the world. Booyah. Seven, wo seven wounded, seven routed. Nice. Uh, can't take anyone prisoner and I can't really recruit anyone because I'm part of the army. And... Some um, beasts. Not really decent loot to be fair. Oh, some fruit. Yeah, that's about it. Awesome. And I level up as well. So I'm going to get another one up in agility, because I can improve my shield skill. And then I'm going to put some more into one-handed and pole arms. So let's keep going to Ox Hall, to the tournament. When I get there, I'm probably going to end this episode, because it's getting on for over half an hour now. Blimey. Time flies. Ooh, hostile force. Okay, highwaymen. I think we'll be able to get there before. Okay, so now we're at Uxhall. Well, pretty much there. I'm going to end that, end this episode here, guys. Oh, what? Oh, yeah, it's night time. Thanks for watching. Uh, please be sure to like the video. It really helps. And I will see you next time. Cheers, guys.